hello friends and welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi hello my name is Kitia and in this channel I'll show you all different types of jewelry that I make either for myself or my shop or something that I have been requested to make today we are going to make the second earring of this little bee super super cute and it's actually really really easy to make as well so this video should be very quick and the things that I am going to use is matte, three different pliers, then I have three different colors of Miyuki beads. These are size 11 slash zero. And then I have some copper wire, silver color. And then I have these bits for the actual earring part. And everything that I use, I will link in the description box. And also in the description box, you're gonna see a link to all my Etsy favorites because I do order quite a lot of things from Etsy. So there's going to be link to all sorts of different beads and all these silver parts and, and stuff. So if you want to have a look at that, you're very welcome to do so. And let's get started. So I am going to take some wire and I am going to take about 35 centimeters and just cut it off. And then you can just fold it in in half like so so you fold it in a half and now you put one black bead on the wire and it just goes down and looks like this and then you take another black bead and you pull each end of the wire through opposite side of the bead like so and now you just need to drag it down but you also at the same time need to make sure that the wire is the same length so you sort of like pull each side a little bit and then just check if the wire is the same length if not then you just need to pull the shorter side a bit more and then it goes to the very end And looks like this it created the little tail here and now we're gonna take four yellow beads and put on one end of the wire like so and then we take the other side of the wire and put through the opposite side the beads like so and then again you pull, pull on each end of the wire until it goes down like so and now we take five black beads and do the same thing so we put them on one end of the wire And then we take the other end and pull it through the opposite side of the beads. And you just pull it so it goes down, like so. And now we do the same thing with four yellow beads. Put them on the wire. Take the other end, put it through the opposite side. And just Pull the end so it goes down. Like so. Now we take two black beads and do the same thing.
like so. And now we need to make the wings. So I take one end of the wire and I put 10 white beads on. Like so. And then we take the same end of the wire and we take the first bead that we put on and we put the wire through the first white bead. And then you pull the end and it creates the little wing. And now we do the same thing on the other side. Take the wire, put 10 beads on. So, and then we take the same end of the wire and put it through the first white bead that we put on. And then we just pull it. And the second wing is done and now we take three yellow beads and do how we did in the beginning put them on one end of the wire and then take the other end and pull through the opposite side like so and then when you drag it down this is how it's gonna look and now we need to do the top part and a little is it ears? I don't know. Or eyes? Is it? I don't know. But the top line and those bits. So we take two black beads and put them on one end of the wire. Like so. And then we take the same wire and we put it through the first black bead. Now, instead of pulling it all the way, we're going to leave, I don't know, a tiny bit, maybe like this. And then you just start turning this part like this. And you just keep turning it until it kind of like doesn't leave much space there. Like this. And now we do the same thing on the other side. So we take two beads. We put the wire through the first one, pull it, 
and again we don't pull it all the way we pull it approximately so it matches the other side and then we hold that black bead there on the top and we just start turning the wire like so and now we take two yellow beads put them on one end of the wire and take the other wire and put through the opposite side and drag it down how we did in the beginning like so and now what we need to do is just take that wire and put through some beads so what i'm gonna do is just take the end and i will start with this one and i will put it through the black bead You can use pliers to just pull the end. And then I'm just going to turn it around and then I will put it through some of the white beads on the wing And now you can just cut off the end. And now we do the same thing on the other side. We just put it through the black bead. Pull it with the plier and now you can just put it through some of the white beads Then you can just go off the loose wire. And this is the bee done. And now, actually, you don't even need to make a earring. You can just, I don't know, make put it on a necklace as well if you want, or attach it to like keychain or something. I just put it as an earring. And now I am just going to take one of the jump rings. This one is four millimeters. And there's like the little loops here. And I just take one and put the jump ring through. Take the earring part, put in the jump ring, and close it.
and this is it. That is your super cute, super easy bee earring tutorial. So pretty, aren't they? I will put a picture of how it looks in the ear, but I think it's absolutely gorgeous and easy to make. So if you enjoyed this video, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And if you do make these earrings, let me know in the comment section how it worked out. And if you want, send me pictures on Instagram at Raspberry Co UK. And I will see you next time. Bye.